all right folks so it is time once again for another latchkey food review and uh today we're gonna do a little review of a breakfast sandwich that i like to get at a place we call the sonic <laughs> america's favorite drive-in last time we came here and done breakfast we got the uh breakfast burrito but they got some breakfast toaster sandwiches i think that's what they're called i'm not sure but uh we are uh pulling into the local sonic now and uh, i really like that this particular sonic this is one of the older classic ones you know that they still have around got the classic drive through looks i think this one was made back in the 90s and people packed the house here this line right now is packed this sonic right here i'm telling you the people show up for it all right so yeah yeah we got some breakfast choices here we got a number 16 it is a breakfast toaster you can get it neither sausage or bacon Today we're gonna go with that uh, sausage because you know <laughs> that's my preferred. Uh, I prefer you know sausage you know on a sandwich you know and, and, and bacon too sometimes depending but I, I it depends on the situation with bacon if it's a BLT yeah I like the bacon on there as the sandwich but most of the time i would prefer my bacon you know like a part of a already well-established sandwich like a cheeseburger or something to that nature so but anyway i'm gonna sit here in this line and wait to get up to the sign so i can order it may take a few minutes so uh we'll see you whenever we get our food Okay, so I finally made it to the sign. We're just waiting on them to chime in and take my order. Still got a lot of cars ahead of me. But... The combo is only six dollars and twenty nine cents. That is not bad. That is not bad for an entire sandwich. Yeah, let me get a number sixteen with sausage and uh, a diet coke. You want fries or tots? Let me get tots. All right. Anything else? Uh, that'd be all. All right, thank you. All right, so you see that? You hear that? 7.33 for the entire medium combo. And the good news about Sonic is you can get that all day here. You don't have to just get it at breakfast time. I think some other restaurants ought to take note of that. Hint, hint, Hardee's. You definitely need to take note of that. Your best-selling items come from your breakfast, for sure. Uh, but don't get me wrong. I love you. I love you, cheeseburgers. Don't, don't ever stop with those either. You know, just do like everybody else. Combine everything into one menu all day long. You know. Uh, I'm pretty sure Hardee's would be on top of the world if they was to try something like that. I know they would. Matter of fact, the town I'm in right now, I'm going on a rant that I shouldn't be going on. We'll talk about that in another video when we're talking about Hardee's. But, <laughs> but I got some things to say about Hardee's. I'm going to do a whole week on just Hardee's, I think, you know, coming up in the future. Uh, if I can make it happen, I'm trying to, you know, work it out where I can make something like that happen. But, uh, all right. Uh, we'll see you when we get our food. That's it. That's enough rambling from me. I'm a, still one car away from the window, so I'm going to cut you here, get my food, and then we'll talk to you about it. 
See how good it is. See how it tastes. All right. Talk to you then. All right. So I got my food. So I'm just going to pull over here. Find me somewhere to eat real quick. Try to pull down on the other end where the building blocks me <laughs> from the people sitting across from me there. Or that. Everybody can't see my business. Except for the workers who may be coming to their storage shed right here. But anyway. <laughs> so we got tots. And uh, I need to spend some more time at Sonic doing some reviews. I know some out there that put some really negative, nasty stuff about Sonic out there, but there's some things on this menu that are worth talking about and getting for sure that are amazing. <laughs> I see comments like, they should become a drink only place. Oh man, that would be a tragedy if we could not come here and get their onion rings. A real tragedy. But yeah, there's all kind of stuff I have not gotten off of this menu that needs to do reviews on. Anyway, this is their breakfast toaster right here. Okay, so. What we got here <laughs> is a toasted sandwich. And it's got sausage, egg, and cheese on it. But anyway, that is it right there. <laughs> oh, man, this thing is good. It is good. I'm digging it. I don't know how Sonic does it, but they got the crispiest, best tasting tater tots of any place I've ever tried. There's always something to get here. It's a little different from everybody else. Like here you can get a corn dog for Pete's sake. <laughs> this is a pretty decent sized sandwich. The egg is not overpowering like most places. They got good, it's good egg. That combines well with the uh, sausage and the cheese. I'm here to tell you it does.
sausage, egg, and cheese toaster, folks, from uh, Sonic. Definitely worth the seven dollar investment. If you wanted a meal to eat for under ten dollars, this is the way to go. This is the place to go. This is the meal to go with. All right, folks. I'm going to take this last bite. We're going to finish up right here. And uh, we'll talk about it coming up in the afterthoughts next. All right, so my final afterthoughts on the uh, Sonic Sausage Egg and Cheese Toaster. <laughs> Breakfast toaster. That is. I uh, feel like it's a definitely a two thumbs up sandwich for the price uh seven bucks you know you're eating for under ten dollars an entire meal there you know with the sandwich and the hash browns and your drink uh that's hard to find these days and times it's, uh, with all of that stuff on the sandwich uh standing together it's very satisfying sitting in your stomach uh i ain't got nothing bad to say about it uh some people may be put off by it because uh it doesn't have any type of condiments on it, but come on, folks, this is Sonic. They have packs of mayonnaise and mustard that you can order or ketchup or whatever you want. They even got, like, salsa for their burritos and stuff, and they'll pretty much give you what you ask for, at least the one that I deal with does. Uh, I ate that with nothing because I feel like the cheese, the melted cheese on there was a standalone uh, and didn't really need a condiment like mayonnaise or anything because uh, it was fine the way it was prepared I enjoyed it like that but uh, you know just saying you know some people might have a complaint about something like that but you know <laughs> Sonic is one of those restaurants if you ask for a pack of mayo or mustard or ketchup or something like that they're gonna give it to you hands down and you can just easily put it on yourself you know just like olden times but uh some people may like that, you know, some people may not like certain condiments and uh, they can just uh, order it as they please. Or you can just order it with mayo on there and they'll put it on there for you or mustard or whatever. But anyway, just just figured I'd put that in there, but otherwise, you know, it's, it's a two thumbs up breakfast item. Uh, I enjoyed it. I thought it was good. Go try one for yourself and let me know what you think. Alright folks, that's all I have for this review. So until today, you folks have a good one.